you're looking at a 1958 Chevrolet half ton factory Napco truck short bed step side Got brand new mud terrain tires, chrome, chrome wheels, eagle alloys. Plenty of tread in there. The one thing you'll notice about this truck is how well the doors and the gaps fit. Although the truck has been painted several times, it doesn't appear to have had any major body work. Very nice chrome on the front there. This area is what we believe to be the original color, this, the teal. And you can see that up underneath the undercoating. Again, the gaps. And the doors fit very nicely. Probably nicer than many of the Apaches we've had in here. The bed appears to be the original bed. It does need to be replaced, but it is there. You'll notice that a lot of the typical trouble spots, they have been fixed at some point, but they're not thoroughly rusted through at this point. On the driver's side, you have the worst parts of the rust here on the floor. There's three sizable holes right here. The rest of the floor is pretty solid, but the drivers does need some attention. The running board have a bit of rust in here, but for the most part are solid. And the hinges are solid. The one thing that will need some attention is the driver's door, as there's some rust in the bottom of the door. And there's one other spot over here that it's not rusted through, but it has bubbled underneath the paint. The rest of the truck is very solid. The frames are solid. There's no rust on the frames. On the frame, or the undercarriage, really. See the pictures and the listing for more information, more detailed photos there. <clears throat> Inside, you do have the original gauge cluster, but we do have an aftermarket radio and some gauges. Original headliner, it's in good condition. Obviously the VIN plate and the 5,600 pound uh, weight ratings in there as well. Starts right up. Radio works, stereo is pretty decent. Let's take a look under the hood. Wipers do work. Comes with the original spare and the side mirrors. Under the hood, we've got a Crate 350 that's relatively new. Uh, coupled to the original transmission, original driveline, original Napco driveline. Got an Edelbach uh, carburetor on there. Headers, dual exhaust, and this truck pulls really well. If you look underneath, you'll see you have the original Napco components, front diff. A transfer case. And you'll notice that the cross member is riveted to the frame, which is a telltale sign that this is an original fa factory Napco. There you see the original color. This truck, although it does need restoration, is a great driver right now. It retains much of its originality and would be a great driver or restoration candidate.